Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover and thank you for joining me here back in Old World Blues playing as that day of Realm of Diana. Now I'm not sure what happened to my accent there, but right now we have a focus to do and a couple comms to go through, such as Hecate's or Hecate's army. I think what we want to do is get down the robot refugees, so we gotta do the mystery caves first. The mystery caves, a vast network of connected underground springs, is a sacred yet feared place for the tribe, occupied by fierce fire ants. Its beauty and fresh water is kept from them. We shall send our military robots to clear it of any danger, and harvest their genetical strand for study, giving twin mothers access to the caves. Get some some money, no, some water. Three building slots, and we end up with a sample of one fire ant DNA. Great. A couple comments to go through. I asked you guys yesterday. Or in the last video, really. Ooh, common ballistic weaponry. We might do that. Which area we should put the Gek into? Some of you guys said that we should do Twin Mothers, but we cannot do Twin Mothers because, well, it's too developed right now. So, we... Someone also recommended that we do the Mystery Caves because... Because Mystery Caves sound like fun. Which I'm totally cool with. So, let's go and do that. In three months, we will have a bonus for construction, agriculture, and two civilian workshops, three infrastructure, and more electricity and water. Beautiful. Thank you for commenting, everyone. Who did comment? Let's see... Ballistic weaponry, we... Yeah, it looks like we are going down that way, so... Might as well, right? Cool. And are we justifying on anybody? We could invest in more monthly population. We're currently investing... Or... or constructing a war goal against the con uh, Scrapper's Compact. Cool. And which will keep trying to beat up enemies, you know, the good stuff. And pretty much take as many people out if you would like to read this. This happens pretty much in every campaign. Exploration for technology. Find a leader for the party. Or we have no men to spare. We'll help them out. Why not? I think we can help them out. Another comment was from the last video that I keep getting my droids of Diana pierced because they're basically light tanks. They're only six in common with, but they don't have enough armor, so they're constantly getting pierced. Which is obviously not a good thing. So we're probably at this point going to start investing more into Goddess's Reach. These guys are only 20 combat with. I will make these guys 40 combat with. Of course, once we get enough robots. So... It's going to take some time. You know what? Just make one for now. There you go. That saved us about 200 more robots, which is not bad. we got plenty of po monthly population for now. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and start investing a little bit more into military factories. Just, I guess, one for now, but that's totally fine. Because, well, we need them. Let's get some decryption as well. We definitely need more military factories. We don't have enough, especially if we want to take out the hangdogs eventually. Send us some manual prospectors. We're developing a project La Gareta Caldera. And we go to war with the corroded fields. Uh, the pass. I'll... Oh, develop our U6. Well, I think we got enough money to help invest in there. Very good, very good. And we can only get two and a half political power a day, so be it. We could core stuff, or we could do this monthly population stuff. We get 5% more every month, so be it. Wow. Ah, screw it. I don't need to core stuff, right? Well, we will need to. And I'm done doing that for a while. Cool. And do we have enough planes? Not really. Monoplane fighters are not bad, though. Let's get them up. Ah, just go, do 50 for now. We can always duplicate them later. Cool, cool. And you guys are stationed over here against Lubbock. While you guys, my robots, are stationed over here. Now, do these guys have anti-tank? Yes, they do. So, actually, I'm going to go do this. I'm going to put you guys over here as well. Just because I want you guys to attack. Because I want to not use my robots too much. Because I don't want to have to make more equipment for them. 110 days. Eh, that's not ideal, but whatever. That'd be alright. More divisions. Not bad. Oh. Okay, Circle Junction got some more manpower. Cool. This is the F1. Roman Diana. Salida. Circle Junction. Cool. Very good. The Mystery Caves. So then, we got Mr. Handies. We can do Robot Refugees because we want to get Doki Doki as a general. While the robot's deviation in programming is indeed the result of a massive glitch and corruption of their core function, who are we to judge if they are now truly alive or not? We will threat them fairly and offer them a home in our midst for them to rebuild. May they find peace amongst the Twin Mothers. We get more multi population or no, we just get more manpower in the Mystery Caves, and it's now core of our city, and you're named a Robotown, or Robot Town. Very cool. Mr. Gutsies, Mr. Handies, let's grab some more max speed, thank you. Another division? Okay, Legion. Can we send the volunteers? Yes, we can, actually, if we really wanted to, but I'm not going to right now. Ooh, that actually might be too many. I don't want to have that many guys. I don't mind maybe making another army, but really don't want to invest too much in infantry. I do want to use more robots. Ooh, look at that. Scrapper Council. Did they attack us? Not really. That's so be it. So be it. If we have both people, both armies attack, we should do more than fine. 
especially with air superiority, so. Shouldn't last or lose too much. Five thousand. Wow. Hundred and sixty-two. And eh, might as well get more factories that way. Maybe. Maybe a little bit more. See what happens. Very, very good. Doing a pretty good job, I'd say, so far. Put some group here, then attack these guys. Attacking the Amazon Warriors. We're running out of energy, which is not good. Frequency analysis is pretty good, though. Let's grab some long-range radio. Anything else? Not yet, nope. Twin Mother's NCR Embassy is gone, so we get probably less weekly mm, political power. Yes, we do. Kind of sucks, but that's okay. Come on, guys. Get to Chickasa. That'd be very bueno. And military research half a chocolate bar rations. It's kind of cool. Less supply consumption goes down. Our supply consumption period just goes down. All right. Let me get a few more of this. A little bit more of that. And then maybe a little bit more of civilian workshops, actually, just because we needed more industry. Always make at least one line of civilian factories for now. Oh, you guys are getting beat up, too. Good. Good for you guys. Hmm. Boulder Dome. More research and building technology research speed. Eh. Not really interested in that stuff right now. And we've taken them out. Good job, guys. Good. I'll actually keep you guys down here, if supply permits, and then have you guys come right here. Beautiful. More divisions? Don't mind if we do. For now, at least. At least for now. Alright. Probably stacking all the soldiers up there is probably not a good idea in that little area next to that one group, but that's okay. And the story's a family. In light of our fair and just treatment of the refugees, Doki themselves have decided to help us end leader troops into battle with their impressive computational capabilities. They've also taken upon themselves to vastly improve the former mystery caves into a sprawling robot city and share their wealth with us. Cool. Four civilian factories. Nice. Very good. Vehicle designer. I guess we could probably go and grab this one. Uh, I'll do it eventually. I'll do it eventually. Cool. Ah, you guys will be fine. You guys will be fine. Should take too much longer to go to war with these guys. The Chained Choir. Wow, that looks... The first chorister. You got me really interested now. Hmm. Kind of a generic focus, but that's okay. Hmm. Time up for me. Alright, anyways. Industry. Backyard workshops. Kind of have to do that. Kind of forced into that. Even though we should probably reduce coring costs for stuff, but whatever. Do you want to go down this way, too? So let's go down here, actually. And then maybe get to Castro Sol Rubrum. Because we don't own Red Sun City, which is fine. But it's going to cost 160 political power, which is, you know, fine as well, actually. You guys, the Navajo Nation is not doing well, actually. Is it too late to send them volunteers? It might be. You only send three, huh? Oh, look at that. Nice. Ooh, Mr. Handys. I think police protectons are better, so... We just need to research that for getting focuses done, so... Ooh. I don't want to hurt our production and stuff, but we need more resources, really. Uh, in any case, we have plenty of scrap. Go ahead and do that. We'll need that stuff. We'll need that stuff, too, so... That'll be fine. Did we send volunteers? I thought we did. Has reasons to be hostile to us. And that's that's fine, but yeah, I guess they rejected us, huh? Yeah, that's sad. So sad. Oh well, it's your funeral, not mine. Mm, there's only two divisions there. Actually, you guys. Okay, I just found something great. More encryption and decryption. Very cool. You guys, come on down here to Lubbock, actually. And it looks like that's not an area here that we could go down, but that actually is. So you guys actually go right. Uh, you guys should be right there. Okay, right there. Oh, there goes the Navajo Nation. Should have asked for forgiveness. Precision motors, very good. Assaultrons. Sentry Mark Bach 2s. This is all a little bit ahead of time. We can get Mr. Gutsies. And this will have support robots. Yes, these are considered support robots, which is good. Compound bows, very good. Uh, go right there. Special project pursued. Nice. Very nice. At this point, you know, you know what? Screw it. No more of that stuff. Uh, we'll keep it on five. Keep it on five. 
which should help out with this. So many more resources over there. Anything else? Grain solution. No, nothing really. Nope, don't you see that? Agricultural stuff. Research speed could be pretty good, actually. So where's the family? Good. Now let's go back over here. And we need to do this. Basic foundries. Advanced recycling. Twin Mother's Relay Dish. Let's do that one, why not? Ensuring continued communication with Twin Mothers is capital to the stability of the region's board and the nursery. Constructing a communications relay and its necessary infrastructure will both improve the stability of the region as well as extend our scanning capabilities. We need long range radio next. I could core that. This has way more factories, so it's only 162. That's really, really good. And we'll get 2.3 still a day, I think. Even less, 2.2, which is not bueno, but hey, you know what? We'll take it. We shall take it. Beautiful. And we oh, oh we got more resources too to use. Oh, it's so good. Yes. Hey, my, only minus four. That's actually not bad. Can these guys pierce us? Probably. No, maybe not. Well, actually, I mean, you know, they don't have anti-tank piercing. They, they still have a chance of piercing us. Oh, was it not these guys? We, oh, it's these guys. We could go to war with. That's right. Right? Oh, wait. Who? Oh, the Chain Choir. Yeah, it's you guys. There we go. Then you guys. Going to war with Lubbock. I'm avoiding the Hangdogs because I'm, I want to take them out later once we have enough divisions because they have... There's a lot of holes in our line, so we can't take out these guys too. Well, maybe we could take out these guys and these guys, maybe. Chain Choir, thank you. Uh, we'll obviously give most of this to the other group. Oh, boy. Uh... Uh, yeah. You can have that. Watonga Correctional Compound. Sounds like a great place to be. Cool, thank you. Nice. We could train him, but now nah. Fall Chichen, Chichen Itza. Cool. Good job, guys. The last patrol. Yes, the last patrol. Well, well, since there's no provisional state of Texas or government government of Texas, I think it'll be okay if we if we keep taking more Texas and Oklahoma because I don't think anyone else will. So could be wrong about that. White legs in the 80s are at war. Cool. We're going to go to war with these guys eventually as well. You guys, go and train again. Robots only minus 1,000? Minus 400 or really 360-ish? Uh, we, we're making some, some, some support equipment too, so... Can we throw any support equipment on our Amazons? We're already doing really, really well. Wow. Heck, we might even make maintenance companies on our guys. To get capture equipment ratio better and more reliability, but meh. Maybe not so much of that stuff. What do we have? Ooh, we need anti-tank. Yeah, doggo's not looking bad. We gotta research a lot more stuff, actually. Monoplane attackers. There's so much that we gotta research. Of course, the land auction is done, which is pretty good. Ooh, special forces. We might get more hardness. Let's go ahead and do... Hmm. I love researching this stuff. Recovery rate. I think we can wait a little bit longer for this at the moment, because while I love this stuff... It can definitely wait for now, especially with maybe better planes. Maybe we have so much air XP. We have actually a lot of naval XP. Obviously, we're not going to do anything with the Navy just yet, but that's okay with me. Hopefully, it's okay with you, too. After this one, though, we shall do Supreme or Support Robot Subroutines. The Mr. Handy model of robot contains much knowledge in its data banks, mostly pertaining to cooking and housekeeping, but also to more efficient use of material owing or owing to its military construction heritage. Making use of this wisdom while running computational subroutines will help our cause. We get one computational power... And, ooh, more resources. Yay, very good. Cool. And then we'll go to war with these guys. Who the heck is that? Are these the Freemasons? The Last Lodge. Oh my goodness. Grand Matron Sofia Cortez. Hmm. Hmm. Thumbs up for me. And they got some ghouls. And them ghouls, hopefully they can't pierce us. Good enough. Let's see what we can do. Long range radio. Yes, don't mind if we do. More Amazon warriors, yes please. Get you guys and go right here. Oh, actually, let's get some more research speed first. Advanced circuitry. Now we attack them. And they can they pierce us? No no, they cannot. No no. Hey, look at that. The pass, thank you. More money, please, please, please. Got plenty of money for now. Until the Legion wants to kill us kill us off. Then maybe maybe not. If you guys help support the attack for now, you'll be fine. Oh god, Mexico is on fire! Santa Ana, you have gone crazy. The Legion and the NCR are still not killing each other. The White Legs are doing pretty well, it's even against the AD, so not too surprised there. 
Man of Prospector? Sure, why not? Lord's Anointed is gone. Goodbye, Lord's Anointed. You barely had a chance. And make sure we continue doing this. Robot City. I love Robot City. We are going to really make ourselves very strong here. Very powerful. Hey, minus 800. Almost 200 missing from there. Good. I love Lubbock. And then we'll deal with this stuff. It's going to be kind of annoying, but that's fine. Whatever. We will... Wow, these guys are exploders. I'm probably going to be mostly using infantry. Maybe they'll waste their attacks on my infantry. Maybe... I don't want to hurt these guys too much. Do need to train them some more, but that's fine. After them, I'll probably go to war with maybe Pecos Colony. Treasure Trove? Our men... Oh, our men have not only found a few places of old world technology, but a successful working prototype. Butcher Pizza is extremely pleased with our success, offering for offering a favor for anything in their ca capability in the future. 200 more manpower, 180 units of infantry equipment, skill and training pays off, more opinion, more army XP, and we have a chance of getting a 65% research bonus for one of those things. Cool. That was a great thing. Usually it doesn't work well for us, but hey, I'll take it. Good. Backyard, backyard stuff. I'll grab even more, but we have a bonus. Let's get constructions. Spending construction stuff for now. That's fine. Cool. We're doing really, really well now. As long as we don't go to war with the hang dogs, and as long as they don't go to war with us, we'll be okay. Love it. Thank you. Cool. Alrighty, uh, tidy. Uh, here we go. There you go. Have you guys go right there. Alright. Seven go right there. Good luck with that. And then I'll throw one, two. Eight right there and see what happens. Last eight, just kind of hang out. Yeah, you shouldn't be suffering any attrition, which is good. And hopefully, no one else will go to war with us. Oh, and you go right there. Support robot subroutines. Yes, please. We need to get a healthy tribe as a happy tribe. Focus done. Mechanized training. Overcharged ammo. Eh, or basic infantry equipment. Collecting specimens. Ooh. Oh, we get a research slot. I should have done this earlier. The inauguration of the tertiary wing of the repository will now allow us to properly store irradiated DNA samples taken from the wasteland fauna, and with it also comes new scientific facilities to process said samples. All this could result in the future possibility of even integrating useful DNA strands into willing citizens. Oh, yes. I want to play the role of God with Diana. Yes, please. And I, we're going to record this next just because I want to get down to the past as fast as possible. 33,000. Plenty of factories, and we can go to war again. I love how fast we can go to war in this this mod. Oof. These guys are next. 60, 60 days, that's so nice. Three, two... Actually, you know what? I want to build up some air bases down here, too. Oh, we already have some. But we'll need that for these guys, too. Oklahoma will be ours. Unfortunate. How do you fall ill? I mean, you get a virus. You got a virus, probably. You're not attacking, okay. Well, I guess we'll have to force them to see the ways... Of, the errors of the ways... Can we win by doing this? Maybe Mr. Gutsy's cool. Some more hardness. I like it. We like it hard. Uh, anything else? Ooh, how to hunt Marlurks? No, nah, we're not really fighting the Marluk tribe, so we're kind of good. Investing this in the past? Why not? We still have almost 900 caps, so. Fuel injection. Monoplane attackers? Why not? Are we still making... Well, maybe that's why. Maybe we're not making casts. Maybe we should make casts. Cass is so good. I love Cass so much. Oh, Mr. Gutsy's looking a little better, but nah. Higher production cost means better soldiers, right? Oh, Wichita Falls. Oh, wow. We're not doing great right there. Uh, with that lost 2,000, we've lost 132. Not really worried about it. Hey, Santa Anna and his brother killing each other off. Awesome. The good thing I like about late game is that a lot of the nations already are taken out, so you only have to fight quite a few fewer nations. So look at the white legs. It's got, like, dead horses... The Uinta tribe, uh, Painted Man, Zion, so I'm glad that that's already taken care of. Uh, let's see. So, with this group, we have to fight all the pl Great Plains by ourselves. Are we just fighting on Pecos next? Who are we just fighting on? Yeah, last Patrolman, good. The last Patrol, not Patrolman. It's fine, it doesn't matter. Whatever, they're all going to be dead in the end anyways. I guess technically, just like us. But we shall embrace it. Wow, some of these guys are really good. Really Worn soldiers. I'll put you over there. And I'll put you over there. Make sure that this is really high. That stuff will get done soon enough, which is good. And... Hello, Adjunct General Christopher Harrison. Oh, they're out of manpower. Oh, it should be easy then. It should be really easy. Come on, I just want to help out, help out cities and stuff like that. Come fly with me. 
Nursery raid our improvement stuff. Yeah, why not? The regions born in the nursery are still unknown to us, but not for long. We will put our robots to work on a secondary wing of the command structure or command station with a specialized uh, radar dish. Its powerful ways will let us map the area fairly effectively with minimal error, while also improving our compu computer infrastructure. We get a little more stability, which we don't really need. More computational power, which is great, which I love. Get three more infrastructure and one more radar station. Don't mind if we do. And we have another research lot. God, D Diana's a lot of fun. As long as you can cheat your way uh, to killing off Lanius, which you can still do legitimately, don't get me wrong. Someone said I was a cheater for, you know, just taking everything from Lanius. I take advantage of any situation I... Or normally, I take advantage of whatever situation I can get. I mean, I was considering not like straight up annexing them because we don't we didn't really deserve it yet. But it's over. It is what it is, you know. Whatever. I'm just here for a good time, and if the game says you won, I guess I won. I really want to pump up these numbers on how much we can actually. Oh, this game just found something. Hey, wow! Watts consumer uh, electronic schematics. Cool. Thank you. Uh, 2.25 we currently get for the nursery we have 61.5 com computational strength awesome we want more satellites though so all right since I started training these guys and that happened care of an ambush if we like to read about that go right ahead but we're gonna at least try to get rid of these enemies except you guys can keep doing that if you need to cool and then I guess we'll probably let's go to war with Pecos next actually because there's gonna be very little that separates us and Santa Ana Oh, well, spy buck, cool. This should not take too long. Bricks, I love bricks. That's already done. Computational strength. Uh, let's get the basic foundries. Generator, advanced militaries. We get there right there. So, because that's one of the things that it's a focus requires that. So, that's a little bit ahead of time. Let's grab this one. No, let's grab the digital data links. So we can get even more research speed and reinforce rate. Love it. You guys, if they can even even if they can pierce us. Doesn't matter. Go, Helia. Go, go, go. Uh, yeah, not much else around here. We need to do a lot of research, man. Lots of research. So how many people do we get a month? 168? That's not bad. It's not great, but not bad. Good. Thank you. Can you break over there, maybe? Can you guys get over here, maybe? You should be able to break over here. Can they pierce us? A little bit, yes. Song from the front of you, I'd like to read about that. Go right ahead. I'm going to grab more political power. And investments falling through. We recently had a woman in here who pitched a great idea. Attached small boxes to mole rats to deliver messages around the wasteland. It was genius. No more couriers and mole rats working for scraps. The one issue we did not anticipate, however, was that mole rats don't enjoy boxes attached to them. Too bad we already bankrolled Miss and Prince. We can afford this. Ask for a small loan. We can, we can afford that. Cut our losses. It's fine. Just break over the river if you can. That'd be great. And we... I've done it. Awesome. Yeah, these guys are not too difficult. Now, the Native American tribes here might be a little more difficult. I mean, I guess they're... Are they... Hello! Whoa! The Cherokee Nation just popped up. I'm glad we were looking at that. I didn't know they could unite. Actually, I'm a lot more interested in playing with as them then. Ooh. We got stuff down there. Is there anything else that gives me a lot more computational power? Hecate's army. We could do that one. Full control of the nursery? Ooh, yeah, let's get that one. So it's come to a shock to many that the nursery, even after all these years, is only partially operational. Fortunately, with our heightened manpower numbers and resources, we will be able to fully restore the nursery's capabilities by repairing what has been damaged over the years, ultimately furthering Diana's capabilities. Paradise gets 10,000 more manpower. Now that we control the outside or land outside of the nursery, we can more properly repair some of the more distant uh, power generators that kept the facility operational. Gain 10 computational power and prepare the nursery for habitation. Awesome. I mean, that's not, that sounds great. I don't see any downsides, really, but... I'm sure there are. Cool. Uh, and the robots are spreading out like, not a cancer, but like a good thing. Yeah, I, now I'm really interested in playing Oklahoma. Oh, we don't get cores on that? I like this. The Cherokee Nations looks really awesome. Some restraints. Oh, you lose. Ooh, weekly stability. That is not good. Because they have unique focus trees too. Really awesome. I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah, since you're here, do we have any water? No, they don't have any waterways down there. Huh. Plus patrol. Cool. Thank you. And I'll send you guys down here as well. We're going to concentrate you guys on the more eastern side of that area. You guys go and stop. You guys go and do that. Do that. Thank you. And then after that, we shall go to war with the Cherokee Nation and finish off Oklahoma. Because we like Oklahoma. I've never been there, though. Well, maybe some of us like Oklahoma. Maybe not. 
So these guys are going to be guarding the waterways. So infantry goes right here. Do we have any monoplane attackers? Good. No, nothing down there. Over here. Yes. 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 So I'm going to actually do that. You guys can stay right there. And Tulsa, huh? You guys go right there, too. Actually, that should be almost good enough. And then maybe go one, two, three. There you go. You guys can go right there. I'll cut them off right there. And then two divisions. Uh, Actually, you should be okay with defending there for now. You guys probably actually have quite a few soldiers. 22,000 manpower, up to 96 divisions. Wow, that's quite a few. All right, more research. Don't mind if we do. Specialized doctrines. We're going to wait on that for now. Ooh, let's grab some recovery rate. Let's grab some of this. Train penalty reduction. Yes, please. Nice. Good, good, good. 30%, 50. There we go. So daggers, very good. Let you guys get come on down south. Do we have any more planes? Technically, yes. Wanna play fighters? Don't mind if we do. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. 50. Actually, we're going to get 100 to go here. And then throw you over here. And then throw you over here as well. Plenty of planes. Plenty, plenty, plenty of planes. Nice. Another robot army. Why don't we? Led by Doki Doki. Oh, Literature Club. And got to start reading. Or actually playing. Gun Nut. You're going to be a robotics expert. I'm not, I don't even care. And with more attack. Yeah. Armored Hardening. We like it hard. Assaultrons. Ibots. Support robots. Are these heavy robots? I think they are. What is their speed? Six kilometers. Eight kilometers. Four kilometers. Do we want... I don't know which way should we go. We can't get these special ones, because this one I think is locked, unlocked for the warden, I think. I'm not sure how you get scurry bots either. So, what combination of heavy robots should we use? Should we use Robco brains? Sentry bot mark twos? Or assault trons? Because iBots are probably pretty good to use. iBots versus police protectrons. They're both considered support. So these have more defense. Hardness is 35% for both. Breakthroughs, this actually has more breakthrough. 18 more, of course. More suppression. I'm not going to use them for suppression. Same armor. Way faster. Same piercing. Uses more cells. Barely costs more to make. So we'll probably use iBots. But what type of heavy robots should we make? Let me know in the comments below for this campaign, because you never know. Soltrons versus Sentry Bot Mark IIs versus Rubble Brains. Actually, you know what? I'll help you make a decision more with these on screen. Oopsie. My bad. Sentry Bot in the middle, and then Soltrons. Soltrons on the left, Mar Sentry Mar Mar Bot Mark IIs in the center, and then Robco Brains. Let me know in the comments below, because actually these guys have 20 armor, 50 armor, 35 armor. So, let me know in the comments below. Alright, time to go. Even though these guys might be able to pierce us, they do use some militia, which is nice to see. We should be able to win, especially with air superiority around here, right? Should. I'm going to the robots to force the attack. And I'm going to probably convert, actually, all, a lot of these droids of Diana to switch over to combat robots once we have enough. But we're doing really well in support robots now. Wow. And plenty of infantry equipment. Holy cow, we got a lot more political power, too. There we go. Full control of the nursery. Great. Uh, automated healthcare? Reboot protection network. More attack for every leader. So, rad scorpions. Rad scorpions. More defense. I like more attack. Offer tribute. No, I don't think we're going to offer tribute. Last days of an old friend. Let's do a reboot the protection network. Uh, actually, we'll do that a little later once we get uh, at least a few more generals first. Let's wait. That might be better to do. Organic processing. Ooh, more compliance for 800 days. That's not bad. Increase the town. We can't do that one. Automated harvesting. Hecate's army. Well, we'll do, deal with that later. Fire ant DNA. That looks pretty good. Let's do that one. The fire ant's genetical sequence and its potential application mostly pertain to its intrinsic understanding of its fellow ants, as well as organization and groups. And while it would be certainly horrifying to try and integrate a hide like mentality, we can still splice more common traits like intrinsic body language and understanding and pheromone dispersion. Awesome. I think we're doing really, really well. As long as we don't fight the Legion, we'll be okay. Drop tanks. Even more range. Don't mind if we do and get some more uh, ground attack. Close air support planes go burr. Actually, with you guys here, we can actually do this too then. Doki Doki. No, don't fall ill. Oh, you're. Oh, you're just one big old line. Okay. If that's the case. You guys go right here then. Screw that other group. Two's good enough for me. Boop. 
Beautiful. One, two, three, four, five. There you go. You guys can train anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Two, ar two armies of infantry are probably going to be my max for what I use for this campaign, so we'll see what happens. Uh, oh, you're still over there. That's fine. I'll probably hit the area again, because again, 30 divisions is pretty nice. When is the Legion going to go to kill itself or go to war with anyone else? A long war. Ah. They must have lost a battle against the NCR then. Cool. And there goes Pecos Colony, my friends. Thank you, Pecos. You had quite a run. Alright. We're going to put the most... Most strongest? No, the strongest soldiers over here. I'm going to put you guys over here. And that's pretty much ready to go to war then. How much money do we have? Only 934. Eh, why not? And we don't want to forget. Let's pause it real quick. Boom, 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 boom. Van Horn. Yeah, most definitely not bad. Not bad. There you go. Very good. Actually, Oklahoma City, not bad. Let's do that one, and then uh, boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. Cool, Santa Ana. I might go to war with them once they're in another war. I'm, I'm sure he's doing probably pretty darn well at this point. Naval, naval production. Eh, I don't have that much manpower. Quite a few divisions, so we don't have that nearly as many as he does. I'll go up here then. I don't know if we get war goals against these guys later on, but we'll just do it anyways, because we can. Go and stop training, and prepare to go to war. How much would it take to cost? 168. Not bad. Well, first we gotta do one of these three. Let's do that one first, maybe, factory wise. Yeah, that's, a, that's the most factories. There you go. And even more resources. Look at that. So good. So good. Alright, well, I guess it's time to see what happens. Good or bad, here we go. The future of war from the past. Now they attack us immediately, which is fine with me. Although we can win and hold. Let's do Memories of the Traveler. I remember now, he was a fun one to converse with and all throughout all the hardship he endured. He never lost his wits. Over the years, he's made a bit of a name for himself, but I haven't seen him in quite some time. I'm glad I have met him, and I hope he is Will. Or well, not Will. Maybe his name is Will. Hopefully he's well, though. Digital data links, advanced military is good. Gonna grab some... Radar would not be bad. Let's grab some digital encryption. And continue on our journey here with basic foundries. Awesome. Let's see. 700, they're increasing their casualties by a great amount. We actually might have an equal number of divisions, but probably not pursuit. From the brigade, next time we would be prepared, so be it. Diana. Daily compliance, it's so good. I like Di Diana. She's actually a lot of fun. The devs, I think, did a pretty great job with her. There might be a few bugs here and there, but you know. What game or mod does not have a few bugs here and there? Alright, so they wasted some manpower. They're wasting some more manpower. And they're out of manpower. 80 factories. I don't mind adding 80 some rough factories to us. Why not? Alright, robots, teach them a lesson. Force the attack. You guys, you must help attack as well. Everyone else, not so much yet. Adaption, doctrine, good, eh, might as well do that. Uh, I, I love that they added Oklahoma, Texas. Uh, man, I just, mm, I love it. I really do. Daily command power gain. Recovery rate 10%, yes. Yes, a thousand times yes. We might struggle here and there, but it doesn't really matter. They shall all perish before Kaiser? No. No, this is Diana. 8,000 cow trees for them. Not bad. We're actually doing really well on combat robots and doing a lot better on support robots. So we're doing well. Butcher Pete request lower tariffs. Requested we lower our tariffs imposed on trade throughout our nation. Our taxes damage the bottom line. They seem to be willing to negotiate some alternate agreements with us later for this favor now. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. As long as we have to really focus on money too much, I think we'll be okay. Good, good, good. Anyone have upgrades, actually? No, no, no. That's disappointing. That sucks. It's alright, though. Invest stimulus in the past. Might as well, right? About to get paid. Actually, we have 8 E9. That's not bad. Of course, we can only have so many... Ooh, so many uh, divisions before things start really hurting us. For you guys... Actually, could you guys take these guys out by yourself, maybe? If we made enough divisions? Perhaps. Uh, prepare the nursery for habitation. Moves capital to paradise. Adds 10 building slots. God dang. 
normally only had a few select souls living within the nursery, the honor of the tribe now. We need to prepare the nursery for the wider occupancy. We need to establish living space for quarters, temples, and nurseries. Where's paradise? Oh, it's all the way up here. Oh, I'm glad we got it, but that's dangerously close to the enemy's board over here. But it's pretty far away. Yeah, that is dangerously close. Oh my goodness. Actually, if we would lose this Craig, Kriag, we would be cut. All other divisions would be cut off. That's actually probably not a good idea to do right now, but whatever. Memories of the Traveler. Memories flood back to me and as of someone I had forgotten. They were the Traveler of Harold. Harold was at one point or another a person from Vault 29. After selecting him to be one of the, those to visit the nursery, after, of course, a sample amount of code in order to prevent him from telling others of it when I left, or when he left, we found him to be a rather pleasant company, enough so that we would keep an eye on him, or on them, as they left and traveled the wastes. I remember stories of him helping vaulters defeat mutants to the west. I helped tribals stop pre-war regimes and even moving to Alos for a time. I had a brief chance to see him recently. I used one of the fruits of his unique botanical head sprout. He called them Bob? In order to create a vaccination for the, to the new plague. Last I've heard of him, they were traveling out east. I hope wherever they end up, they are happy. Oh, wow. Oh, man. Ooh, uh, hijack additional satellites. Upgrading our radar arrays with digital data links technology has provided extremely interesting results as our scanning dishes have found multiple additional satellites in orbit. Right for the taking, connecting and diagnosing the remaining capabilities of those orbital objects could let us add additional functioning satellites to our network. Cool. I want more vaults now, though. I would like a lot more vaults. You guys can go ahead as well. I think we're doing pretty darn well here. If we force even more attack. Let's see, go back to engineering. Let's grab over here and get some more construction spending. It's construction spending? Construction stuff. Oh, we captured a trade node, the first people's junction. Awesome! More robots. Derp. Oh, I have robots, not bad. Thank you, Cherokee Nation. Very cool. Very, very cool. Actually, I'm going to throw the other robots up here too, probably then. Just in case. Just a little bonus. Nice. Sultrons, we'll, we'll always search pretty much everything over here anyway, so. Let's see, actually, can I replace police protectrons with these guys? Cool. Invest stimulus in them too? How much money do we have? Oh yeah, we can. Nice. Eh, it should take too much longer to go to war with these guys either. Nope. Joel Warren, Washington Brotherhood. Very good. Very, very good. Hmm. With their dogs. Capture the Warren. Very good. But you guys, I'll probably put you guys down here. And there's a lot of little holes around here. We're going to need a big army to take these guys out, too. Hmm. Oh, do you have an upgrade? No, I gave you robotics expert, even though. Nah. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Yeah, we gotta take out the hang dogs as soon as possible, probably. Probably. Not bad. And we can core this one too? We could. Economic resurgence, great news. Yeah, we'll do that one. Because we can. Joel Warner Annex, good job, guys. Yeah, I'm thinking hang dogs in next. This is gonna be a really terrible war. Can we actually put at least one t division per tile? Chug water. Yeah, we might as well. All right. Uh, is anyone in their alliance? Denver Defense Network doesn't look like it. Going to go to war. Got plenty of manpower right now. Actually, if that's the case, I'm going to go ahead and do this. Put a level 1 fort or along all these areas, just in case. Guys, level 1 forts aren't too difficult to make. They're pretty speedy being made, so that'd be fine. Central Australia. I'm not sure about that. If that's Central Australia right there, but that's, you know, whatever. New casings. Yeah, get some more stuff right there. Hecate's army. Nothing down there. The fields, Brahmin DNA, guns for caps, syndicate councils, let's do that one. The second level of the hierarchy deals with safety and security. By establishing local governments made by and for the people, we are able to deal much more closely with the need of our people, providing reassurance that we are here for them, and they shall always keep them secure against the horror of the wasteland. Sounds like a good idea. At least for now. At least for now. Lord of the Waste, we have become a major power within the wasteland. Oh, luminous ones, cool. Thank you. It didn't take that long. 
And that's what we like to see. Ah, uh, we can build up Oklahoma. Texas is hat. We're looking really disgusting how we uh, formed ourselves here, but whatever. Cool. Alright, so I'm going to leave U6 down here. It's not going to be very good, but that's fine. You know what? I'm going to do the same thing. Level 1 forts. Followed up with you guys. Now there's tiny little ways into this area here. Hopefully we can drain them of strength, because this is like the major boss battle before we fight the Legion, so... Is that it? Oh, that might be it, actually. Nice. Ten divisions might be good enough. You know what? Just throw all twelve in there, then. Now, you guys... If we can hold there, we can hold here, maybe. As long as we make more divisions, we should be okay, right? God dang it, I made you guys down here. Oh, you're just... Oh, you're infantry. Hmm. That'll be okay. Boulder, come up there. We'll get some guys out. Some more. That'll be good. You guys might be able to hold it. And then you guys, while you're all going to defend a single line here, we're going to have a very, very strong right flank. And you will push in like crazy against these guys. Anything else? Luxury goods. Ooh, space survey. Basic boundaries. Diane attempts to regain control of a number of satellites that add to her current satellite network strength. Network through methods such as Enigma cipher cracking, pre-war military operational guides, and analysis, and advanced trigonometry. So, 30% chance of finding no satellites of use, 30% chance of uh, increasing it by plus 2, 20% for plus 3, 10% by plus 4, 7% by plus 5, and 3% by, by plus, plus 8. Wow. Boom. Let's try it. Digital encryption, postcode modifications, why not? And for now, let everyone train if they need it. Improved field rotations, recovery rates, more recon for your ar entire army, yeah. Heck yeah. You know, let's grab that one too. Inherent mechanized knowledge, might as well, right? More liability is always good. And we actually have enough robots for now. Now, obviously, our guys aren't good enough. Like, they're going to get pierced and stuff like that. I already know that. But once these guys are gone, we'll pretty much be in for the long haul. Because we have all of Oklahoma. After this, we'll pretty much have all of Colorado, minus a little part of this stuff. But after that, just going to war with Santa Ana it will not be difficult because he's getting walloped. Legion should not be too bad once they kill off the NCR. The White Legs would be kind of a pain. High Chapel. Old Spokane State? Is that a university? Albert Kershaw. A protectorate of the Washington Brotherhood. Man, that looks really cool. I know the old country used to have a focus tree for them. I forget who made it, but there is a focus tree for them. I don't know if the mod still works. Like One of the mods that works for it. It might not be available now, but I don't know. No, let's go just do that too. Why not? Good. And um, we get 195 a month. I mean, that's really good. Especially when we have, like... Do we have doggos? We do have some doggos, yeah. Ooh, New Vegas, cool. And then we should do Bitter Drink, because why not? Uh, powerful healing liquid brewed by the tribe. The Bitter Drink is, as its name suggests, extremely bitter, yet very effective at the caring for the body as well as the mind. Its soothing effect after ingestion is remarkable, and it suffers none of the cloudy effects that the healing powder has. We should make sure to encourage them to brew more and more of it to heal our people. More building slots? Don't mind if we do. Cool. Training, 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 training. Making ourselves as strong as possible. This is very good. Actually, we do have about the same amount of soldiers as they do, hopefully. 180 factories. Hey, we got back to here. Good. Even more civilian factories. Marlux Space Survey. We can do that again. Our satellite network has changed by plus 8. Oh, wow. We actually have the plus 8 one? Current satellite size. Oh, well, we had a 3% chance for that. God dang. We actually got that. Cool, let's do it again. More space stuff. You can look at that through here. Uh, better decryption factor, air range, accents goes down. Awesome. And orbital decay route 2% every year. Satellite network will suffer decay due to solar radiation, orbital decay, or debris collisions. The rate of decay increases as our network grows larger. Which kind of sucks, but, you know, whatever. Side channel attack? Might as well. No good, more robots. Alright, we can all stop now. Because I need to get these guys a little bit stronger. You guys are going to get the crap beating out of you. <laughs> Just going to put that out there right now. Yes. We have some gunships? Wait, when do we get gunships? Oh my goodness. When you go to war by October 24th, which is fine. Go on down here, and then I'll put you over here. 
Monoplane fighters, those are nice. I'm gonna throw a few more on, which is fine. There we go. Now, we make plenty of that. Oops, do I f uh, how many do we have on these? Oh, we don't have that many, actually. Okay, cool. Well, I'll boost you up by even more, because we're gonna need more. Hey, Rob Ghost Ultrons, I'll let you guys decide whether we'd use that or not. And since you bought Mark II's, let's grab this one first. Okay, let's see what happens. We're probably gonna get beat. Let's not beat out of us. Now, they immediately attack us here, which I knew they would. Oh, and they're actually beating us up, so good luck. Strong right flank, immediately proceed. Now, we, you might get pierced, but as long as they can't kill you, that's what matters. Do we get pushed back yet? We have not, which is good. They've already lost 700, we've lost 45 ish. Not bad. Strong right flank. And then the infantry will come in too soon. And just go ahead and go in. Because we throw them in, we get actually the, we can actually use the planes that they use as well, so. That'd be good. They don't need that much command power for this area, which is good. Oh man, they're getting the robots beating the snot out of them. Come on, Doki Doki, you can do this. Just in case, kind of hold on for now. Side channel attack, great. Let's grab some more research speed at this point. Zax technology, who can? Zax can. Better drink. Organic processing, we could do that. The fields, um, we could do that. Offer tribute, let's go ahead and do Waste on Amazons. Uh, Hecate's army. Is there anything else on the left side here? Oh, the harnessing heat. Geothermal sources can be found throughout the blasted hellhole that is a wasteland, and even within our own territory, we have many areas that have been designated as hazard zones because of the scorching heat. And slowing geothermal generators over these areas could power the factory further, bringing back some of its many additional functions. Yes, yes, yes. If we lose here, you know, so be it doesn't really matter. How many have we killed off? I was thinking at least 2,000, but I'll take the 7,000 dead enemies. And we have more divisions than them, than them now, which is awesome. Could you guys actually win? Eh, you might have the potential to win, but we're going to hold off for now. Good. Only 2.23 every day. Space surveys, the last one, we got plus 3. Which is okay. Not great, but it's okay. New systems care package, meh. Space survey. Currently, we are at 23. I would like to core a little bit, a few more areas first, though. I mean, this place isn't that worth it, but that's fine. Second Massacre of Bitter Springs, cool. More robots? Don't mind if we do. At this point, I think we're doing really well. No, I don't need to see that. Thank you. Guys, I, I do... There's a lot of men. Oh, you lot of men. Come on, man. Nope. You can't escape. Bye-bye. At this point, I'm going to let everyone attack. Go, go, go. Contact lost. Well, that's not good. Immediately send a rescue team. We found the expedition. Great. Civilian reconnaissance. Awesome. And re reinforcement plus 25%. Good lord, that's so good. Inherent mechanical knowledge. Ooh. Less attrition. That's okay. But I guess we might as well, right? There's so much in Old World Blues now. I love it. So much. Love it, love it, love it. Dog City. Oh, man. We've only killed off, what? 20,000. Jesus Christ, that's so good. Well, I guess we can go with this, guys. I think after this, we might go to war with the White Legs. I think someone's got to take them out. Uh, do they finish with the 80s? 80s are looking pretty thick, too. Wow. That is... I'm sorry. I've got, I've got to intervene. That is just not ideal. Aesthetically, it just it hurts my mood. That, that got, that's so much better. So much better. Why can't, why can't they just do that normally? All right, at this point, I think we're doing pretty darn well. Base survey, eh, we could do a little later. Invest in the past, we get 97 caps, not bad. Um, we did that one. Hey, hangdogs. I'm loving Diana. This is this is very fun. If you've never played Diana before, I would highly recommend her. Hey, freed slaves, great! If you would like to read about that, go right ahead, because we've got to keep on trucking. Another free manpower, aw yeah. Beautiful. You know to really crush these guys really fast? I'm gonna do this too. Because we'll have one. We gotta divide the armies up now, pretty much, so. These go right there. Half you guys will actually go right here. 
harnessing heat. Great, I love it. And then, new casings, because we can. Every few decades I have to swap out my containment vessels as the preservation gel tends to get crusted and the gel gets too far uncomfortable. It's about time for a swap. This time I'll have a robot handle and handle it instead of that prisoner who helped me last time. Very good. Very bueno. Very, very, very bueno, I would say. Is that the only waterway through here? It looks like it. Uh, uh, the rest of this can do that, so. Come right here. Because we're going to stack so many soldiers on the line here. So many soldiers. Cool. Doesn't even matter at this point. One more time. Eh, probably not in this episode. So we'll end it here then. We have done very, very well, friends. Very, very well. I hope you enjoyed the episode, though. If you guys enjoyed it, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. We are done building infantry. But, like I said, I hope you enjoyed it. If you, and check out my Discord link if you haven't already in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow when we finish off Colorado, take out the White Legs, and just continue expanding the realm of Diana. Wow, Mexico looks bad. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.